continuing our series on the quest for the best family off-road camper, we take a look at the mid-range XL model from Hiker Trailer. With the sleek design and cost that is just as attractive, this could be a solid contender for the best family off-road camper, but there are a few things you might want to be aware of. You know you can take this. Awesome. Hiker Trailer is a bit of an industry veteran, having been in the business for nearly 10 years. That's long enough to iron out all the kinks, says Robert Reeve, the CEO of Hiker Trailer, who was gracious enough to give us this tour. What we like about this trailer is that it's very purposefully built. From the design of the suspension to the size of the door, everything has been meticulously designed around actual real world needs. This is a smart approach because you're not going to end up with anything extra. This keeps the build process simplified and the cost down, which means saving money as a customer. But there are some key differences between Hiker and the other companies that we've talked about in this series. One of those differences is in the standard option package, or rather, the lack thereof. Everything you see here is an optional add-on. From the outdoor shower, to the solar panel, to the front toolbox, everything is an option. This means that the customer will get exactly what they want without paying for anything extra. But on the other hand, it can make the process of deciding which option to add a little daunting. Flat space is a premium when off-grid, and with Hiker, you're going to get a lot of it. But at the same time, there are some big differences when compared to the other trailers. For one, there's no sink, which we found odd considering there is an option to add a hot water shower and a 20 gallon water tank. There's also no option to add a battery bank, instead relying on a tight integration with Goal Zero. Another pain point for us was the location of the refrigerator, which is away from the galley. In the back door, the galley opens out instead of up. This means no roof to protect from rain or the sun when stopping for lunch. The inside of the mid-range XL from Hiker Trailer is spacious, but it is constructed of wood. There are a few reading lights and additional lights that will use the power from the integrated Goal Zero. Let's talk about the off-road capabilities. With the ground clearance of 18 inches, it's right in line with the other trailers that we've covered, and it's using a solid torsion axle and a 5-on-5 five -five lug pattern, so replacement parts are readily available. The optional water tank add-on is protected, but the corners are not, which makes them prone to damage, as well as the rear stabilizer jacks. But if you don't do a lot of intense off-roading, this is going to be a good option, especially considering the price, starting at just $10,000. Not to mention how lightweight they are, starting at just 1,400 pounds. But one of our criterion for the best family off-road camper is off-road capability. And to be honest, we'd be a little nervous taking this into the places that we go. But they do have a model that's better suited for those types of adventures. This is the extreme off-road model from Hiker. It also uses a solid axle, but this model comes equipped with leaf springs and shocks. Strangely enough, the ground clearance is less than that of the mid-range XL coming in at just 14 inches, but that should still be enough to get you to camp. The extreme off-road version also comes standard with the medium tongue box and integrated storage solutions like frame-mounted storage racks and underfloor cargo storage. This model currently starts at 15,000, with the average build price coming in at about 24,000. It's nearly 15 feet long, six and a half feet tall, and weighs just over 2,000 pounds, so it's incredibly lightweight and towable for most adventure-capable rigs. Overall, the models from Hiker are really appealing. They are customizable, well-designed, affordable, and lightweight, which means less stress on your rig. But we're just not sure this would be a good fit for our family. It doesn't have a sink, it doesn't have a stove or a dedicated power source. And although you can add a rooftop tent, this would make it too tall to fit into our garage. So the quest for the best off-road family camper continues, but we'll be keeping an eye on future offerings from Hiker Trailer. So what do you think about this from Hiker? Do you have any experience with them? Let us know in the comments below.